infrastructure constraints seem to be uh, the major, I think, constraints. Um, but there are others such as uh, regulatory environments and uh, institutions within which some of these private enterprises uh, operate. In the, say, the, a couple of cases that uh, I looked at which were specific to Ghana, for instance, um, I think mobile technology, mobile phone technology is becoming uh, one major uh, way by which people overcome uh, some of these infrastructure constraints. Um, in the case of uh, the, say, the Barclays case, um, well, certainly the mobile technology was quite key, but um, just normal uh, bicycles, motorbikes, uh, because they needed to get the uh, the susu collectors, which were the traditional financial uh, intermediaries, uh, to reach the very remote parts of the country uh, or of their clients. And in doing that, um, where the clients were actually in areas which were not accessible by car, um, you needed to physically go there to be able to collect monies. And so in uh, some of these cases, what uh, the parent company, if you like, or the nucleus company, which is Barclays, that was actually to get uh, either bicycles or motorbikes uh, for the susu collectors. Depending on um, how the customers uh, learn in terms of uh, getting used to the financial uh, intermediary um, sector, eventually the bank hopes to bring them on board uh, through giving them uh, facilities. Initially, they'll be giving them facilities through the um, susu collectors, but that has a cap. So beyond that, um, they would certainly need to be formally or directly related to the banks. The key, which is the model which makes it work, is the fact that it's built on structures that are traditional. Traditional structures in the sense that you are using um, susu collectors who have been doing this thing for ages. Uh, in the informal sector. And uh, these arrangements are based more on trust uh, than anything else. But you're actually building on these traditional structures to deliver on uh, that particular good or services. So um, in that sense, I think it's certainly uh, replicable.